I'm scratching my eye. Five, four, three, two, one. What is Darth Vader back there? That's weird. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday night for us, Monday morning for you guys. I know sometimes we say we're exhausted. We're exhausted. For a good reason. We had great fellowship today. Mm -hmm. Sunday service. Here's the thing, though, is because the church had a birthday slash movie night. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For my upcoming, it's my birthday on Tuesday. Yeah. And because it's in, Mod because it's in Modesto, we didn't come home. So we literally went to service this morning, left here at 8.45 in the morning, and just walked in the house, uh, what, 20, 30 minutes ago? Yeah, what time is it now? I don't know. It's almost 11 o'clock at yeah. night. So we've been at the church building. Well, after service, we went to eat and did some errands, but we haven't been home. Yeah, because we, we, we went to eat, washed the car, and then we went straight to, I had to set up and get everything ready. Yeah, but, um, yeah, I really appreciated everything you did. And did you enjoy yourself? Yeah, and everybody that came, you know, and then, to end it with watching one of the Star Wars Phantom Menace mm -hmm. from the um, the first one, you know, and we had it at the church. We have like full sound system and subwoofers and everything. Mm -hmm. It sounded like IMAX in there. Yeah, it was loud. And that was really fun. Yeah. And then I shared my birthday with Eduardo. It was his birthday today. Mm -hmm. Which yeah. was which he's a Star Wars. Yeah. Uh, Fan. He's a Star Wars fan too, which worked out perfect. So it was pretty awesome that both of you guys. Now we know. That's yeah. pretty awesome. Well, I, we've. He's always said he's a fan. No, now we know that your birthdays are so oh, close. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's pretty cool. So, um, Sharon took my Darth Vader <laughs> to the church. She did this whole Darth Vader uh, Star Wars setup with all the desserts and, and the finger foods and stuff. And she took my Darth Vader. So I, he's uh, part of the devotional today. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, um, man, I'm really, really tired. Like I can feel my eyes tired, you know, and, um, but we didn't want to not do a video, you know, to at least, you know, say hello to you guys. And um, I really, honestly, guys, I really hope you were able to watch today's service or oh, yes, yeah. yesterday's service. Yeah. If you didn't, please watch it. If you did, I can't wait to see your comments because when I post it live, it doesn't show me the comments till the next day. No, oh, okay. You know, but I'm really curious to th if you didn't leave a comment. I want you to comment on it. I'm really curious on, on what your thoughts are about some of the things that I brought. I want to watch it. I actually was going to ask you if we can, after this, just kind of just relax already and just, I want to watch it as we're oh. going down to, to go to bed already, but I want to watch it again. I really do want to watch it again. Um, I was really, I was really, really blessed by it and, um, I don't know, the Lord just really, I feel like the Lord just had, was speaking to me through the whole message. Um, he just had a lot to, he just had a lot that, that he was speaking me to me through it, you know, through the whole message. And I don't know, I just, you know, I just feel like I, I needed to hear, I needed to hear that today. Yeah, it's just, you know, when I was um, when I was writing the sermon last night, I thought about the week, you know, because actually we were doing something, and I said, I know what I'm preaching on. Remember, mm -hmm. I forgot where we were somewhere. Who knows? We were mm -hmm. somewhere because you were buying the stuff to make well, the. I think it's been through throughout the whole week. There's been a few different events. That's what I was gonna are, say. Yeah. So last night we were. You were getting stuff to make those little cakes. Yeah. And I said, I know what I'm going to call the sermon. 
So I knew what I was going to call it, but I didn't really know the content of it. And then stuff kept coming to me. And then some situations or conversations throughout the week with, throughout different, the people. Week with different people. And, and I, you know, you know what? You didn't tell me or anything. Yeah. But I realized throughout the different situations. And I'm like, huh, you, you didn't have to tell me because I realized that those situations kind of shaped the sermon the, the sermon yeah because i was like he that it shaped the sermon mm -hmm. and i said it's making sense to me because of the situations that took place throughout the week and i yeah. realized it you didn't have to say anything because it and, and and it's not that you even shared anything but i've been so observant yeah over the situations throughout the week um, and, and it's not that me and you sat there and had a conversation over it either, mm -hmm. but I have been very observant to what the Lord has been, um, you know, what's been happening that I realized it. And I said, wow, you know, just so you know that I have been observant. Yeah, my, my whole thing guys. And even though as Christians, we know this, I wanted to just solidify who Jesus is. Yeah. You know, who he is and his placement and and just talking about the Bible and, and the, the logos and Rima and the difference mm -hmm. of that and how some people um, unfortunately put the put the Holy Spirit aside and instead put the Bible there. Yeah. When when the Bible is important, you know, I always see it like this is is the Bible is the compass. Yeah. And the compass points to Jesus. Mm -hmm. But a lot of times, it's like we forget Jesus, we forget the Holy Spirit, and everything becomes about the Bible. So we get all this head knowledge. Yeah. You know, and, and we got to recalibrate sometimes, man, and and put things in its place, you mm -hmm. know. Um, so I don't know, you know, I, I think today's sermon was really important. I think many people have to hear it, and maybe they'll hear something from it. Yeah. You know, and... But, man, you know, from the moment it started, um, I really, truly felt um, the Holy Spirit stirring from the gate. You know, a lot of times when I, when I preach, it kind of builds up. And this one, it just, boom, like, it was just like a takeoff, like a yeah. rocket, instead of a, a plane that slowly ascends, you know. And um, I, I, think, I think if we don't understand and if we don't... Um if we really don't take heed to understand um, this message, um, we we have to be very very careful because we end up we end up pulling people down with us. Yeah. You know, we end up pulling some of the people uh, we love and down with us, and we take them down on a whirlwind with us, and um, we become accountable for that. You yeah. know. And um, and we don't want to do that because sometimes we do it not deliberately, and it's just because we 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 do it um, without without knowingly. Um, it's not deliberately, and it's unfortunate because we don't take the time to really search. You know, yeah. so we have to be very very careful. You know the part that that jumped out at me that I was not in my notes. It's something I didn't realize till I was saying it. Was John was a Jewish man. And now he's an old man on this island. Mm -hmm. He had to have known the book of Isaiah. So I didn't ever realize the placement because it says that he heard the voice saying, I am the Alpha, the Omega, the beginning and the end. He had to have known as a Jewish man, that is God speaking to me. Because he had to have known the book of Isaiah. Mm -hmm. But then he turns around and he sees that it was Jesus. Yeah. You know, oh, yeah, because the, the, well, that's why I said the great reveal, like the undercover yeah, bosses. Yeah, yeah. That great reveal, that great like reveal. Jesus, like I'm about to show you who I really am. Yeah. You know, and that was, to me, that was not in my notes. And I'm just like, man, that just stood out to me, you know, and... um yeah, guys, hopefully it blessed you if you did watch it. And if you didn't watch it, please take some time to, to watch the sermon, you know, and, and, 
and it, um, I think it'll be a blessing to you. Amen. Um, but guys, like I said, we're really exhausted. My wife is really exhausted. I seen her when she does her baking. I don't know how to bake. I could just sit back, you know what I mean? I don't know what she's doing, and I don't even think she would let me help because she's very articulate when it comes to the stuff that she does because she does it with excellence, and I'll just be big old clumsy hands in there. I don't know what I'm doing when it comes to baking, you know? So, But I know I know that um, I know it's tiring, mm. you know? Mm. I know it, it's tiring, but I, I know you did it for me, and I appreciate you so much. Of course, babe. You know, and um, it really meant a lot. And but now, you know, we just want to, <laughs> we just want to relax and we want to rest. And then um, and that's pretty much it, guys. We just wanted to say hello to you guys and God bless you and uh, pray that you have a blessed day, a great day today. Yeah. You and know, we're, we're praying for all you families. A lot of the families that are um, that have uh, been affected with. You know, with, a lot of families. Yeah, a lot of families that have been affected with COVID. You know, we continue to pray for you. Um, you know, because we we have been reached out to with Pastor Lydia and um, just Pastor Lydia. I know. Oh, well, Al's feeling sick too now. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're we're just praying for you all and um, know that we love you guys and yeah. we're thinking of you guys and. Teresa, Alan. Yeah, just all of, the a Ruans, lot of our families. The yeah. Ruan, Ruanas? Ruan, yeah. Ru yeah, just Ruans? Many, many yeah. of our families. Um, and a lot of people that, that were around these people that yeah. they don't know yet, but... Guys, yeah. you know, all, all we can continue to say is... Um, please, 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 even the weather is really, really cold, just, um, you know, wear your jackets, you know, keep yourselves warm, cover up when you go out there, make sure you, you know, you wear something warm, don't be going out from hot to cold without covering up, properly being covered, you know, um, cause you know, that cold air hits you, um, you know, you don't want to get pneumonia. Just take care of yourself. You know, use wisdom. You know, use wisdom. Don't don't um don't think that you can't get sick. You could, you know, yeah. just still take care of yourself. You know, don't let that cold air hit you and and um take your vitamins, you know, make sure that you're you're, you know, taking in that warm, you know, fluids and, and stuff. Keep yourself healthy. Guys, you know, please keep yourself healthy. Um, if, if whatever we can do, whatever at any, at any way possible, whatever we can do, what we, whatever we can try, you know, we're trying, we're trying to take small measures, you know, and if it's one, one little moment at a time that you can do it, then, then do it, you know, one small thing at a time, then, then, then do it. That's all we can do, you know, um, make small changes, then, if that's going to make a difference, then then make a small difference. That's all we can do, guys, you know, but but do it. Um, take care of yourselves. Take care of your family. Um, make the small change in your family. And t trust me, every day is going to make a big a big difference. But, um, yeah, I, that's, that's the best advice that we can give one another is to help one another, to encourage one another. But we've got to keep ourselves healthy um, mm -hmm. so that we can you know, stay healthy for, for one another. We got to lift each other up, guys. Yeah. And then, obviously, we want to continue to pray for Brother Anthony de la Garza. Brother, we love you. We pray yes. that you be lifted yeah. up, not only in strength of in your spirit. body, but in strength of your spirit, brother. Yeah. We are here with you. You're not alone. We're with your family, with your mom, with your stepdad. And like he says, he goes, he goes Anthony ain't my stepson. That's my son. Amen. You know, he said that to me today, brother, and I don't know that's if right. he tells you that. I don't know, but that's and, what he tells you're me. Just, and you're not a congregation member, brother. You're you're not just my brother in Christ. You're my brother. You're my family. Familia. You're, you're my familia. <laughs> you're, yeah. you're my brother. You know, there's... We just want you to get better, brother. Yeah. That's what we want. That's what our prayers are in the name of Jesus. For any pain that you feel, I command it to go away right now. 
for any sickness you feel, for any weakness you feel. I command it in the name of Jesus for your spirit to be lifted up, for your body to be lifted up in Jesus' name, for your mind, for your thoughts, brother. And um, and we just love you. We love your mom. We love your your stepdad, your dad, you know what I mean? And we just love your whole family. And I just want you to know that. I want to thank you also for the gift, um, the gift card. They gave me a card oh, really? from, from them three. And, and that's just a blessing. Thank you so, 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 so much, <laughs> you know, Anthony. So um, I think that's pretty much it, right? Yeah. I want to thank everybody that, that really came out and um, spent some time with us. It was really, really special. Um you know, to, to just come out, you know, we didn't, it, for, for, I know for you, you didn't care about having a big old 50th, 50th birthday bash or anything like that. Um, guys, th that to us is, is not a big deal. Like, honestly, we don't care about big old parties or we don't care about you know, big old formal parties or anything like that. We get so excited just, you know. I just want to be with friends and family. You know, that that's all that matters to us, you know, honestly. We can be in our PJs, and honestly, we literally had our, our little kids' rug on the floor, and we brought out some pillows for the kids, and the kids were laying on the floor in the sanctuary. Joseph and... thought her knocked out. <laughs> yeah. Selena fell asleep, yeah. you know, and... We had our granddaughter there, you know, laying down, them. and and um, Xavier, and and oh my god, I forgot the other one. Oh my god, I always forget a little. Uh, oh my gosh, there's Xavier, and what's the other one's name? I forget his name all the time. Help little me. little Alfonso. Little. Alfonso. <laughs> <laughs> he is. He's so. Is that he, the one with the bear? Yes. Oh my god. That's funny. I you know why I always forget him? Because I call him Junior Alfonso all the uh, time because he's always he's he's gonna be hyper like Alfonso. That's <laughs> why. <laughs> yeah, um yeah, because I, I, I was just laughing because he had that huge human sized teddy bear that was bigger than him. He walked in with it and I'm like, Oh my god, what are you doing? It looked with comfortable it? though. It did. The way he was laying on it? All three of them were laying on it for a little while. I was like tripping yeah. out. Yeah. You know, was... yeah, what I appreciate, honestly, is that in my generation, either you love Star Wars or you didn't. And um, so when I saw a group of people there, because we had the little party first, because like my mom and dad were there, they weren't going to watch Star Wars. My brother was there, older one, he wasn't going to watch it. My younger one, He's probably seen it 20, 30 times, so yeah. he wasn't going to watch it, you know. Um, so when I saw a lot of the congregation Desire. come, yeah. <laughs> so my son David came, Abraham was there, Matthew was there, my daughter Aaliyah came, and then my oldest daughter Leanna came with the two granddaughters, you know. But I went up there right before that we played the movie Phantom, Phantom 1, uh, episode 1. The very first one that starts well, everything. Well, because you played it in a in a chronological order yeah. instead of playing it the way they made them, yeah. the way they came out. Yeah, and I said, who here has never seen Star Wars? Most of the hands went up. So many hands went up. I know. And you know what, guys? That humbled me even more because I realized that they were there because they care about me. Yeah. You know, but at the end, they were like, we need to see part two. Yeah, so... You know, because I kind of explained yeah. for like 10 minutes. I said, I want to set the stage. You know how I set the stage with scripture? I went up there and did a little mini sermon on Star Wars. <laughs> Basically, I was like, listen, this is what I tell you right now is, is about to make it better because it'll put you where you kind of understand what's going on. Mm -hmm. This is what's going on. This is what, what it's like. And then let's start, you yeah. know? And um, But I really appreciate... I know people were there... Because it was me, but it was even fun at the end because they're just they like, Because they ended up wanting to see, see the two. next one. They want to see the next one after. At the church because they want to see what the sound yeah, system. Yeah, and they're all like, you know, we want to see the next one. We're all like, really? Okay, let's do it next week. Yeah. <laughs> so, guys, we're going to watch the next one next week. We're all excited about it. 
So, I mean, we're not going to go all out like what we did this week, but I'll you probably know just what? get some pizzas. Or I something. have <laughs> I have some leftover popcorn, you know, because I did individual popcorn packets, you know, and I was like, I got lots of popcorn. And you know what? Let's just do it. So, and yeah. some of the people that we didn't think that were going to really like it liked it, and they're just like, "Can we do it?" And I said, "Let's do it." Like, yeah, let's go for it. So, if you're local and you want to see part two and you haven't seen part one, watch part one first. That way, you can come. I don't, what day are we doing it? Sunday? Yeah, after. Yeah, after service, right? Yeah. Yep. Well, later after service. Yeah, because I because I, it's too light. Yeah. yeah. Yep. So, anyways, guys. Yeah. We're about 10 minutes longer than I wanted to. I should have been laying in bed 10 minutes ago. Yeah. But God bless you guys. Have a great day. Hopefully the coffee was good. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. I never say that. I always forget. But please subscribe to the channel. That way you always get notifications. Hit like if you like this video. And leave a comment. By doing those things um, to YouTube, um, it creates an algorithm that says... Oh, people like it. So then they start suggesting it to other people. They're not even paying attention to me because they're watching you do the weird, the weird, that. <laughs> so let me say it again, guys. If they, you, they heard you. No, they didn't because they were watching you. Oh I was God. watching you. I wasn't even listening to myself talk. I was watching you. <laughs> I'll, I'll make it short in summary. Okay, go. When you subscribe comment or like our videos mm -hmm. youtube it creates an algorithm that youtube now will suggest it to other people because they're like whoa these people like it so they suggest it to others that's it it, it helps the channel grow you know what i really trip out on what do you trip out on a eh? what why you gotta get all weird on me for a eh? what do you trip out how do some really weird channels get like a whole bunch of views i don't know like the other day i was watching somebody like make a really weird something and they had like 20 something thousand views <laughs> and i was like yeah this is really really weird stuff like they were making a little paper mache something like a little craft and it was really weird and i was like how do they have 20 something thousand views? Yeah. Like, like little simple things, like, you know, and I don't get it. Yeah. I, don't, I just don't get it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to make a paper airplane video. How to make a paper airplane. <laughs> like in school. Watch it get a million views. That'd be funny. Like, do we have to start a channel all over again? No, heck no. <laughs> so. That's so weird. All right, guys. Now we're another two more minutes away from finishing. Big deal. You know what? I think I'm tired. That's why I'm just being a brat. Rebellious? Right now. Yeah, I think so. All right, guys. All right. Bye, guys. See you later. See. Bye, Say bye Darth to... Vader. Wait. Oh, I can't reach his button. No way. You can't reach. What do you think? You got Freddy Krueger mm -hmm. arms? All right, guys. Bye. Bye, guys.